Hi, Northwest. Hope you're having a good day. I want to share with you something that you can do every single day of your life that's going to help you be, be victorious throughout the day. And I would call it getting a word from the word. The Bible says to take the sword of the spirit, which is the word of God. Now, when we talk about the word of God, we're not talking about a massive book in this case, because there are two words to describe the word word in the Greek. One was logos and the other rhema. And he uses the word rhema, which means a single word. What God is saying is you need to get a single word from the logos, the main word of God. So you open up the Bible and you read until God speaks to you. And you take a hold of that verse and write it down on a verse card, on a, a piece of paper, memorize it, whatever you do. So you take that verse with you everywhere you go. Today, my verse is Proverbs 30 and verse 5. The Bible says this. Every word of God proves true. He is a shield to those who take refuge in him. And so when anything comes my way today, it could be a trial, it could be a temptation, it could be a problem, a situation. I'm saying, I'm taking refuge in you. Actively, I'm saying that to the Lord in a prayer. And you're saying to me, Lord, you're a shield when I take refuge in you. You're going to shield me from whatever is going to come my way. I'm making God's word mine actively through thinking about his word, claiming the promise, and making it a prayer. And that's what you can do too every single day of your life. Begin your day with a verse. And maybe you take the same verse for a few days in a row, maybe for a whole week. But make God's word yours. I want to fast forward to Sunday. We have an opportunity this week for you to give to the Lord in a unique way. Normally in the month of October, we're asking you to give to support Fallapalooza. You bring candy from Costco and all of our kids get together and we have a, a big festival. It's wonderful. This year with our COVID regulations, you can't really socially distance 2,000 people on campus. And so we're going to forego that this year. But we want to give you the opportunity to support other children. These children are Syrian refugee children in Lebanon and they're starving. They have no way to get food, clothing without outside help. You can support an entire Syrian family in Lebanon with food, the gospel, and clothing for $66 a month. Uh, this is something that uh, we we are doing as a church, but we thought, wouldn't it be nice for you as a family to say, hey, one month, we're going to support one family. And so if you give $66 uh, on Sunday, then that's that can go to that. No, it's, it's designated giving, and so we have to help you to know how to get that money to where it needs to go. Right now, if you want to do that, you can text the word FEED to our phone number, 559-435-2200. We'll send you a link, and you can designate your giving toward that, $66. We'll also have some cards you can pull down, and uh, you can buy the $66 voucher right there, and it goes to support a particular family. Uh, our goal is that 200 additional families would be supported for another month. And we just believe that God's going to do something great for that. I really believe that you're going to be in heaven one day and meet some people. And they're going to say, because you gave to the Lord, I'm here. Uh, I heard the gospel when I was learning how to read at the Menorah Center. I heard the gospel when I was playing soccer with uh, one of the volunteers in the Bacaw Valley. And um, I'm looking forward to that day. I hope that you are too. Well, I look forward to seeing you guys Sunday. God bless you. Have a great day.